How's it guys? Today in this video we have Fakh Duplessis chatting with us. He's one of the fittest players currently playing and he's also one of the hardest working cricketers I've, I've ever met. He will be chatting with us about injuries and his three steps on how he has dealt with injuries before in his career. My thoughts on, on, on injuries, um, I've had a few in my career, um, not too many. I'm very fortunate that there hasn't been any big ones, but I've definitely had to deal with a few. Um, so I'm maybe not too different than any other athlete. Fuff is renowned for his awesome athleticism, his diving stops and his diving catches. He has taken some awesome catches in his career. Um, but I've got three simple phases almost that I've worked through injuries pretty much my whole career. The first one is obviously the injuries happen and you're feeling down and, and you're sulking a bit and you're a little bit negative. I think it's okay. It's not being too hard on yourself. Uh, it's okay to go through this phase, but it's really important that you don't spend too much time being in this state of, of down and negative. So I quickly want to cut in here. I love what he says here, allowing yourself some time to feel the pain, but not doing so for too long is a massive key. The next phase, which is about moving on, um, focus on the things that you can control uh, and really just see the positive side of, of your injury. Um, like for someone like myself who spent a lot of time on the road, the injury gave me an opportunity to spend some time at home. Um, which was great with my family, so I really try to just zone in on the positives of that. But also, I'm also a big believer that things happen for a reason, so I try and take the, um, the, pers the perspective of um, this is part of my journey, so really just accepting that it's all part of a bigger plan. Uh, and then that leads me to phase three, which would be um, starting to put myself into gear for the comeback. Um, so that's really controlling the things that I can do, uh, training the things that maybe hasn't been as strong as they were before my injury, working on different muscle groups, obviously making sure that you rehab your, your injury as much as you can. Sorry, quickly I want to cut in here as well. This is a massive, massive point, okay? Top players like Faf are always looking for ways to get better. And sometimes an injury is the perfect time to make those improvements. But also really zoning in on focusing your mind into how you can get that really strong. So when you come back and you get back after your injury, that you're almost uh, mentally in a stronger place than you were before injury. So let's recap. The three simple steps or phases that Thuff uses to get over his injuries. First of all, he allows himself some time to get over the injury, but he does not dwell on it and he does not stay there for too long. Second, turn that negative into a positive. Always thinking of what is the positive in this regard. What could I, what can I do now that I couldn't do if I wasn't injured? And then third, making sure that you come back, but come back strong, come back a better player, come back mentally stronger, come back physically stronger, just coming back so much better. I am 100% certain if every player follows these three steps Faf has just given us, injuries will actually become a time where players get better, stronger, fitter and smarter. Thanks for tuning into my channel. Please subscribe and click the bell notification button. Until next time. Cheers guys.